Hello, we are discussing about gate 2004 EC paper. The open loop transfer function of a unity feedback system is given. Find the range of k for which system is stable. The range of k for which system is stable generally calculated with the help of Roth Hurwitz criteria. Okay, so first we have to form the Roth array. Roth array is going to be calculated formed with the help of characteristic equation. So it has given unity feedback system that means h of s is equal to 1. Characteristic equation is 1 plus g h is equal to 0. So since h is equal to 1 it can be written as 1 plus g is equal to 0. So you can write it as 1 plus k by s into s square into s square plus s plus 2 into s plus 3 that is equal to 0 and you can write this one after simplification of this one okay you can write it as 1 plus k divided by s power 4 plus 4 s square plus 5 s s power 4 4 s cube plus 5 s square plus 6 s is equal to 0 now the characteristic equation is s power 4 plus 4 s cube plus 5 s square plus 6 s plus k is equal to 0. Because denom denominator also you will get but the denominator will go to the 0 side and it will become 0. So I am not writing this denominator again. So simply if you take this denominator common you will get denominator plus k that is what I have written and denominator is also going into 0 side I am not going through that one. This is characteristic equation. From this characteristic equation, we are going to form the Routh array. Routh array is going to be calculated with the help of coefficients of higher order, polynomial higher orders. S power 5, S power 4, first uh, S power 4 and S power 3, sorry. S power 4 and S power 3 are going to be the polynomials, high polynomials, S power 4, S power 3. So write the coefficients 1, 4, 5, 6 and k. Next s power 2. 4 into 5 is 20. 20 minus you are going in this way. First you will go for the multiplication of this one. Minus. Next you will go for the multiplication of these two things. 20 minus 6 is 14 divided by this 4. So 14 by 4 is 3.5. Next 4 into k and you will assume here it is 0, 0 into 1, 4 into k like this you will go 4k minus 0 divided by 4 that is k itself. Next s power 1, 3.5 into 6 that is 21 minus 4k divided by 3.5 and s power 0, s power 0 means k itself you will get this is 0 term you will get this into k minus 0 divided by this one so you will get k only so now for stability for stability first coefficients of first column coefficients of first column of Roth array should always be positive should be positive coefficients. So if first column coefficients of Routh array are all positive then we can say that one system is stable. So for that one we are going for this one s power 4 is positive because it is a constant 1. s power 3 is also positive because it is a constant which is 4. Next we are going for the s power 2 that is also positive because it is 3.5. Next s power 1 if it has to be positive the term is consisting of k so you are writing 21 minus 4k divided by 3.5 should be greater than 0 that means 21 minus 4k should be greater than 0 so you can write it as 21 should be greater than 4k so 21 by 4 should be greater than k so this is a condition if k is less than 21 by 4 then this term that is the coefficient of s1 rho is going to be positive otherwise it will be 0 or negative okay next s power 0 s power 0 is nothing but k only 
if it has to be positive k must be greater than 0 so from s power 1 and s power 0 we can conclude that k must be greater than 0 and k must be less than 21 by 4 so the range of k for which system is stable is 21 by 4 and 0 the k value must be in between so the right answer for this question is a itself